Would you keep this position even when uh, COVID? Uh, sabi na lang natin, no? impossible naman to eman, no? But but uh, assuming na wala na yung COVID or it has ceased to be a real threat to all workers, would the uh, call center alliance still push for work from home? Ang pinupush po talaga namin ay yung tinatawag namin na hybrid setup which means that for those who want to work in the office because they, they may have their reasons na hindi hindi maayos yung internet sa lugar nila or mm-hmm. sa bahay hindi sila makapag-setup ng maayos or they just want to ano to go to the to the physical office then by all means then they can do so but for those who want to continue working from home Why not, di ba? It, mm-hmm. it works eh. Our, our productivity has, has not significantly changed. In fact, it, ano, some even say that it became uh, higher. Some say the tax collection from the BPO industry has risen from 8 to 12%. So kung, ano, kung ganun, kung gumagana naman, bakit, natin, bakit tayo babalik din sa dating setup okay. na ayun? Uh, since we now have a uh, presumptive new president, a new administration coming in, what would be the appeal, the concern of uh, of the alliance of uh, call center workers to the new government? Ano ba yung talagang sana madinig at gusto ninyong iparinig sa bagong pamumuno? Dalawang bagay lang sa ngayon. Unang-una, yung pagbawi nitong return to office order, yung nabanggit ko nga sa inyo kanina na hybrid setup na kung sana, kung sino yung gustong mag-work from home, sana payagan nila na makapag-work from home pa rin. Kasi we are contributing to the economy still even if we are we are at home. We are purchasing from micro, small, and medium enterprises, yung mga palengke, mga tindahan, mm-hmm. mga karenderia, we're still contributing to the economy even if we're working from home. At okay. yung pangalawa, yung pangalawa, yung codification ng mga karapatan, ng mga BPO workers. Kasi sa BPO industry, we, we have certain unique uh, situations that necessitate certain unique rights that, ano, that we might need to have codified. In the last uh, Congress, there there was a bill filed, the Magna Carta of BPO workers. So maybe maybe Congress can can look into that this time. And so it wasn't passed this Magna Carta for BPO workers. No, unfortunately, it was not passed. But hopefully, in the next Congress, we can work with them. We can we can lobby. We can talk to to lawmakers, and hopefully, this is something that can be well, modified. 